hours of the solution and then I put the same amount of each sample. I vortex them before um, pipetting because sometimes there's a fat layer on top of the sample so you just want to mix everything up so it's a uniform sample. small pellet at the bottom so that's where the bacteria is. Okay. So I'll remove with a pipette all the liquid at the top. The size of the pellet varies depending on the sample and how much bacteria is it in. It's in it, and also sometimes there will be a layer of um, fat that is on top of the bacterial pellet. It just depends on the individual sample. After the extraction process, we end up with strips like this. Each each of these eight corresponds to an individual cow sample, so it's just about 100 microliters of liquid with the extracted mastitis DNA from each cow sample. And then that's what we use to make the plate under the hood, and the plate is what we put into the machine, and it's red, and we get our results from it. So this would be a plate I ran earlier. There are 23 samples here. Here's the sample ID down this side. Um, this is from a complete 16 plate. So the 16 bacterial targets are listed across the top up here. And then, um, so like that's C. bovis, that would be a Mycoplasma bovis. And they're listed across. Um, if I click on one individual sample, so if I click on this one, I can see what the results are for that individual sample. So anything that has a number means that that bacteria was present. So there's 40 cycles. If you're starting with like, say, one piece of bacteria, every um, cycle it would be doubled. So it would go from one to two to four to eight. So if you're starting with more, it's doubling faster. So you're gonna get a positive result sooner. So this would be what the producer would get. They get the sample number, the bacterial finding, whatever's positive in the sample. And then in the quantity column, there's either one plus, two pluses, or three pluses. One plus corresponds to a low level 
two pluses would be a medium quantity, and three pluses would be a large quantity, or high quantity. That one was for the contagious test. Um, let's see. This would be for the complete 16. So you can see there are a lot more targets showing positive, and it gives each one an individual ranking as far as low, medium, or high. We recommend all the producers consult with the vet. We don't offer treatment advice because no one here has veterinary training. So we have that printed on all our reports. You know, we'll gladly answer questions, but we don't want to infringe upon a vet's training and their job because that's not our job.